embed a video in your email and it's 20 times more likely to be opened than if you send just a text. But you have to get your video right. If you don't, it's going to ruin your reputation. My name's Neil Ben and I'm a video coach and I'm going to tell you the biggest mistakes that people make when filming themselves with their smartphone. I'm going to use an example here. I got an email through from an insurance salesman. I'm going to call him Mr. Jones because I don't really want to embarrass him. My name's Derek Jones. I'm an insurance salesman and I've been working in uh, uh, the industry for uh, over seven years, 12 weeks and, and two days. He embedded a video in his email and the email was entitled, I can save you 30% on your insurance. Now, normally I would delete those kind of emails because they feel a bit spammy. And do you know what? I've got a broker and he's great. But I saw there was a video embedded between the text. I thought, okay, this guy's using video, I'm interested, I'm gonna have a look. So I opened his video and straight away there were problems. If you've tried to film yourself with your phone, I can guarantee that you've done this. I'm gonna tell you that one at the end. The next mistake, <laughs> I'm so cheeky because it means you have to watch the end of the video to find out the biggest mistake. And you know what, let me tell you, this big mistake. If you just do this one, change this one, your videos are going to go so much better. The second mistake is he filmed himself with the front camera on his phone and not the back camera on the phone. Now, unless you've got one of those high-end Apples or Androids, the video quality on the front camera is pretty poor. It's used for things like Skype, where you want to keep the file sizes smaller so you can squirt the Skype conversation down the internet tubey thing. But it's not that great for video. So you need to film yourself with the front camera. Okay? Quality is so much better. I'm, I've got lots of interesting clients. Uh, one of my clients works for the BBC. Um, another has a season ticket for Manchester United. And I'm very lucky that I've got uh, a, a, an actress for um, a client well she's not really an actress she's still at drama school but she is very good and I like working her working her, working with her the next thing he did wrong was he filmed himself like he was taking a selfie he held the phone like that and of course his hand was look there you go it was a bit wobbly I, uh, I work uh, mostly around the edge where and um, North London area. I like to travel. Uh, it's good because I work around anywhere in North London. Uh, mostly buses. I'm uh, just a little bit nervous of the underground. What you need to do, you need to mount your phone on a tripod or a holder. Now, if you've not got a tripod, go in your car, take out the car holder phone thing, you know, you've got stuck on a window, stick it on a window, and then you can film yourself. The next mistake he made, and this is quite a big one, he didn't think about his sound. So he was filming in his, his living room and the kids were upstairs playing in their bedroom and he forgot to tell them to be quiet. I'm going to tell you how I can save money on your insurance. It can be any kind of insurance. It can be your car insurance. It can be your... I don't do pet insurance. Um, it can be your home insurance and it can be your life insurance. I uh, don't do holiday insurance either, but I do do all types of insurances. Um, can save you money on that because if you come to me, then um, I save you money. Now, the thing is with video, people are more likely to switch off if they can't hear what you're saying as opposed to the picture's not that great. So it is really important to get the sound right. The fifth mistake he made was, well, his video was 12 and a half minutes long. And 
I only managed to get through 45 seconds of it because the camera work and the sound and the quality and, and his delivery and I was being patient and he was nowhere near talking about the 30% off offer. I got bored and if I got bored and didn't hear his offer I'm not going to work with him. So he killed any chance of me working with him. Book an appointment with me. Uh, give me a call, drop me an email, uh, happy to talk, um, and um, if you're allergic to dogs, it's probably better not to come to my house because I've got a dog, um, I'll come and visit you. But the big one, you know, I was going to tell you about the biggest mistake. He filmed himself portrait like that. Now, our eyes go left and right a bit, not up and down. If our eyes went up and down, portrait would be perfect for filming with. But we're not. Television's a widescreen. Our computers, when they play video, play it widescreen. You shoot portrait, and when you play your video on a computer or on a television, you get black bars either side. Uh... Um, and that shows real lack of professionalism. So, whenever you're filming, make sure you hold the camera that way, the phone that way. And obviously, if you're filming yourself, you've got to do it like that. You don't hold it, you stick it on a tripod, and you sort out some sound. Now, I will be talking about tripods and accessories and sounds in other blogs, but right now, if there's one thing that you do, to make your videos better, film it that way. If you would like your business to stand out above your competitors and video is an interesting option and you're not sure how to do it, then click on the How Can I Help You tab below and book yourself a free 30 minute consultation with me. I can talk about anything to do with video and hopefully I'll be able to help you. See that little button down there? It says how can I help? Click it and book yourself a 30 se 30 second? That's not very long. You can sign up for this blog and there's a, a sign up somewhere. I'm not sure where it is. It might be there, might be there, might be down there. Click on the how can I help you tab below and book yourself a three, a three, a free, for a e -E, 30 minute consultation. Chat with me about what you want to do and I see if I can help you.